Welcome to the New York Indian Film Festival, and you're watching Run It With Robin. I'm Robin Kurian, and thank you for watching Run It With Robin. I am here at the Palace Theater for the 2015 New York Indian Film Festival. I'm about to hit the red carpet, and guess what? You're coming with me. I'm here with Miss Virginia and Miss Model of the Year. I didn't even know that existed. Ladies, welcome to the New York Indian Film Festival. How excited are you to be here? Very excited. Very. This is my first time actually attending this festival, so it's amazing. The most movie that I'm looking forward to is Miss India America. I'm an editor and I edited the film uh, Miss India America, which is a feature film. It's a comedy that's playing on Friday. Pageants and comedy. I like it already. Yes, pageants, comedy, uh, high school girls, high school girls, mothers, cat fighting. This is Samrat Chakraborty. I'm here for Yari Road, the film that is produced by this guy. I'm Hansdeep Bindra. I'm the producer of Yari Road. And we're here at Knife 2015. I'm here representing a short film that I wrote and produced and starred in called The First Session. I thought I was here to see Avengers. Is that not... My name is Vinny Anand, I'm with the South Asian Film Lab, and uh, my script got picked to be read on Saturday. So. What brought you here to the New York Indian Film Festival? Uh, my first short documentary, uh, Should Tomorrow Be? What is this short documentary about? It's about my father. But I'm very delighted that at this festival they've decided to highlight uh, things such as disability and show a demographic which is often underrepresented, which are um, Indian Americans who immigrated to the U.S in the 60s and 70s. They worked hard, they made a better life for their family, and a lot of them are falling ill and sometimes even dying in their adopted country. And I don't want those stories to just go into oblivion. I love that. And and I'm glad that my dad's story won't. I'm here with Sheetal Shaw and Ami Sheth. You ladies look beautiful tonight. Thank you so much. Yeah. And are you excited because you wrote a movie and we're gonna you're gonna be reading it on Saturday. Absolutely. We're super, super excited. My uh, script is called By the Spoonful. It's about a South Asian woman who um, has a really wonderful life, but then she turns her, I guess her life turns so that she becomes a homeless hoarder. South Asian Film Lab is uh, a bunch of actors and directors and, and some producers and uh, a lot of creative people wanting a somewhere, an outlet where we can all get together, workshop stuff, and hopefully from beginning to end have films made. I am here with the director of Margarita with a Straw and the co-director as well, Neelish. Now tonight's screening is pretty big because it's not your typical Bollywood kind of movie. Um, what inspired you to make this, this film? Uh, the story, the character is inspired by my sister who has cerebral palsy and is actually really um, outgoing and amazing and, and, you know, is in search of love and romance even though she's in a wheelchair. So that's something we overlook. We often, we never think of uh, those who are disabled as sexual beings. I, I, I like didn't get censored. Oh, wow. The first thing that were we going to get banned even yeah. on censored. And, and, and the theaters didn't get attacked. We were so upset. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's disappointing yeah. because you expect to be attacked. I expected you to get attacked. I'm surprised. I, I mean, do they have margaritas when they when they saw this movie? It's, it's time to say India has come of age. I am here with Kalki Kekla and you are the lead actress for Margarita with a Straw. I saw the trailer. It looks so good. Not your typical Bollywood movie. How did you get cast in this film? Um, well, Shanali sent me the script uh, and she said, I want you to do this film, but I'm not sure if you can pull it off. My director's cousin, Malini Chib, has cerebral palsy, yes. so um, she introduced me to her because the film is quite inspired from her. Uh, and I you stayed with her for a little bit, right? I lived with her, I, I went out with her, I got to know her really well, we're very close now. I am with the lovely Shayoni Gupta. You look gorgeous. Thank you so much. I'm, I'm wearing Sabya Sachi. Both Kalki and I are wearing Sabya Sachi. So we are the Sabya girls. <laughs> How did you even get cast in this movie? Oh wow, long story. Um, every other actress I know in the country had auditioned for my part. There are a lot of layers to the character, so it wasn't a, an audition where you could just learn your lines and go and, you know, act. It's not an easy film, uh, but it is a, a very easy film to watch. You know what I'm saying? So once they watch the film, they're like, oh my god, this is, this is just beautiful and life-changing. And, it's actually started a lot of dialogues between people and what they think about homosexuality, uh, disability, and although the film is not about that, the film is about any regular person, you know, it's about you and me and everybody else in here 
which because it talks about yourself and loving yourself and celebrating yourself. <laughs> I was told to guard them with my life.